and they're off in the Arlington Classic. And here's Crimson Knight going right out toward the front. Fort Barnes is right there too at the red cap. Wilcox in is up and on this early gallop too with Forbidden Forced on the outside. Legendary King is fifth at the first turn, Sandy's Diamond sixth in between horses. Then Extensive at the inside is Sun Tracer and Pulpitarian as they move around this first turn. Crimson Knight charts the course. Crimson Knight in front of Wilcox in, who's right there, shadowing Crimson Knight through this opening turn. And the opening quarter on Yielding Turf, 25 and 2 fifth seconds. Fort Barn is third at the inside Legendary King. Forbidden Forest is up close to. Extensive is next. Then Sandy's Diamond Pulpitarian and Sun Tracer Trails. Nine lengths from leader to last and leader. Crimson Knight as they head to the half mile pole in the Arlington Classic. And Robbie Alvarado has Wilcox in right there in a position to challenge Crimson Knight for the final four furlongs. Fort Barn is next. Legendary King with that foothold at the fence. And the half mile goes in 51 and 4 fifth seconds as they go to the far side of the course. Extensive is fifth between horses. Forbidden Forest sixth and being asked to pick up as they move to the turn. Then Sun Tracer, Sandy's Diamond, and Pulpitarians at the tail. Crimson Knight has the quarter pole in sight. But here comes a big challenge now from Wilcox in. Extensive is right there too. Legendary King up the fence, then Fort Barn, and Sun Tracer is next. There to the stretch. Three quarters in 117 and three fifth seconds. Here's Will Cox in. Will Cox in strikes the front. Is now quickening away from Crimson Knight. Extensive. Sun Tracer on the outside. It's Will Cox in. And the Arlington Classic. Will Cox in wins by three. In a three-way go for a second. Sun Tracer just over extensive. Crimson Knight.